Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video, which is gonna be my sister's Hindu. What the hell? So it's currently Thursday and the Hindu starts tomorrow on Friday, but today has been a lots of prep. I've done my Hindu nails, which I really like. And I have got a spray tan later for, because we're trialing it for the wedding, like to see what shade we wanna go. I've gotta do the food shop with my mum and I'm basically just gonna be traveling home. I have packed all of my stuff ready to go. There's gonna be so much stuff to take, honestly. But I'm so, so excited. I'm really stressed because this has just been like a lot of planning in the process. No, is that the right way? It's just been a lot of planning and it's finally coming together and we're actually going tomorrow, like what the hell. I just really hope it goes well and I really hope she has the best time. But I'm sure we will. We've got such a lovely group of people going and we're basically going to Huddersfield tomorrow morning. We're going to be leaving about 10 in the morning and we're stopping for lunch on the way and we've basically got a cake made of a penis and we're going to sing like happy hen day. <laughs> So I think that's going to be a great start to the hen weekend. It's going to set the vibes, you know, and then we're going to head to the place so the bridesmaids are going to leave earlier. Go and set everything up, set all the decorations up, make the welcome drinks that we're going to do Prosecco and cocktails for everybody. And then Friday night we have a chef coming to do a three course meal for us and everybody's going to be wearing pink, whereas obviously my sister is going to be wearing white. And then we've got karaoke to do, we've got loads of games made, um, we've got like face masks made of the groom and we're just going to be playing games. There's also a hot tub if we want to go in there. And then Saturday we have treatments for everybody, we have like massages, I've chosen massage or facial or things like that. And that night we're then wearing black and obviously my sister will be in white again. And then it will just be the same sort of things like we're making then dinner, we're just gonna chuck loads of pizzas in, nibbly bits like that. Sunday we have to leave by 10 a.m. in the morning, but the bridesmaids and any family is going for a roast on the way back, just as kind of like end the Hindu in a nice way. And I just think that's gonna, be, I'm honestly most excited for the roast, <laughs> but I think we're gonna have the best time. I just thought I would intro this here and let you know what we're doing because I'm probably not gonna talk to you that much when I'm there. I'm gonna get as many clips as I can because I wanna document this for you guys, but I also wanna document it for me, for my sister, and just as a nice memory to look back on. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. And if you do, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I will see you tomorrow. So, I thought I'd give you a little haul of what decorations we've bought for the Hendo. These are little photo accessories that you put on sticks, just for people to take photos with. We've got some bride-to-be, what does it say on it actually? I think it says bride-to-be on the, what do you call these mother? Confetti. Confetti. Then we have balloons, and this one I think says same penis forever, and we're going to put this up somewhere. Then we have this one which says um, bride to be or something along those lines which we're going to put in her room. We have all of our sashes which my sister's is white and then everyone else's is black and I think it says bride squad on them. Um, these are going to be lovely. Then we have penis straws which look absolutely ridiculous but I think they're going to be great. And we have cups for everybody. We've also got like plastic plates and plastic cups and everything. Um, and other decorations some other bridesmaids have got, so this isn't everything. But we have a tutu, which she's going to be wearing with a Teletubby outfit. We've basically got her po as a Teletubby because she used to like it when she was younger and we just thought it'd be a really nice silly thing to dress her up in. So we've got a tutu to put over that. Just got some ribbon for anything. And then we've got these masks which have the groom's face on them. Do you think Tom would mind me showing it? <laughs> I don't think he'll mind, these are going to be in photos anyway, but we've got the groom's face in masks and I just think they look so realistic, they look great. I've just had my spray tan as well and I don't know how to feel about it, I feel like I look so dark. It's making my eyes pop though, but I've got to wash that off soon so that I don't look absolutely ridiculous. Update on the tan, I've now washed it off and I actually, I actually really like it, it's going to develop a little bit more than this but I really like it because I don't want to be too tanned because I'm naturally very pale, as we all know. So I didn't want my tan to be ridiculously dark, but I feel like this is a really nice, just a little bit of an even skin tone. So I've washed my tan off, I've moisturized, I've ironed my dresses, my dresses for the Hendu. I've got my cases packed. Um, 
everything decoration wise is ready the cake is ready i did do a little bit of diy because the name annabelle on it we didn't really like how the decorator had like just painted it on sort of thing so we bought some icing and i literally just like piped annabelle on it with like a like a square no like a star nozzle so it looks like it does look a little bit better i think i cannot wait and i can't believe that she's actually getting married like my sister is getting married i feel like we're i feel like we're just going for somebody else and not her it's so strange but yeah everything's sorted now i think my friend is on her way over because my friend is also coming on the hendu and we're just gonna have a chilled night watch love island and then we're up at eight tomorrow to have like to leave by 10. honestly cannot cannot wait it's just it's crazy the mother of the bride is excited too I've had a very stressful day honestly doing the food shop was really stressful getting like all the food for everybody because obviously we didn't want to forget everything oh, no. how are you feeling bride lovely nervous <laughs> you look amazing <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling? Cool. Do you know what, Ryan? It's a good camera. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Do you want to get some water? Are you focusing on my mouth? No, no I'm going, um, going past you. It's probably got food on it. Yeah. Happy hen day to you. Happy hen day to you. Happy hen Bit creepy down here, isn't it? I know. about that it feels very creepy down here and the sign says that there's a ghost that returns so that's great little bar bit in here I need to go get a reaction yeah, yeah. <laughs> shit run <laughs> She's here. She's here. Yeah. yeah. Go, go, go. Does Mel got the music? Oh, yeah, Mel. The alarm's gonna go off. Oh, it is. <laughs> oh, my God. I like your cup. Wow. <laughs> oh, There's a whole bloody club downstairs. Yeah, it's amazing. That's hot. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> Me out. Yeah, it's gotta go. <laughs> what's saying? Annabelle, look what's on the table. Look on the table. <laughs> Don't they look good? <laughs> oh my god, look at that view. I know. Look, she says. She's still here. And who? Occasionally returns. Non Sarah. Oh, you got the mark? Yeah, put them on. 
I know. Yeah. Yeah. Nice, isn't it? That's Smelly, have you seen your sign? <laughs> so tired so i will talk to you properly tomorrow sorry i haven't spoke too much today it's just been so busy and obviously we've just been all trying to enjoy it and we've had the best time hello everyone excuse the absolute state of me we just had treatments and i had a back massage and oh my god it was so good i literally could just go sleep now but the plan for now is to just chill, go in the hot tub, and I think we're gonna play some games. We've got like picky bits for lunch, and then later on at five we have a photo shoot. The plan is halfway through. I'm gonna be like, guys, I forgot something. Like I just need to go get something. And then I'm gonna go and get Annabelle's outfit that we're dressing her up in, and just be like, put this on. And then we're gonna play the game beer pong later, and then also Mr. and Mrs., which one of the bridesmaids has made. So I'm so excited to play that. And then we're all gonna be in black tonight and obviously Annabelle's gonna be in white. And yeah, it's going really, really well. I think everyone's having a really nice time, especially Annabelle, so I'm really happy. It's just really nice to see everybody here, like for her, everybody's putting in so much effort and so much thought. It's just so lovely. She's got such a lovely like group of people around her. I mean, that's the guy in your porn star. <laughs> you can shot it if you want, shot it. Yeah. Yeah. Now shot the porn star. Yeah. <laughs> Prosecco. Down, down it. Down, 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 second night well it is the second night it's currently half past 12 
this evening we had the photo shoot that was so good and we just had like pizzas and picky bits again for dinner and then we played games we played mr and mrs um we played like guess the dress of the bride we played like we had to write down a memory a favorite memory of ourselves and the bride and she had to guess who it was with that was so so nice I honestly nearly cried and then we played then we literally like just did a karaoke for the whole night and it was great but oh my god I am so tired honestly my feet I feel like I've been on a literal night out honestly I do have really weak feet anyway but like honestly I'm shattered so we're gonna go to bed and we have to be out of here by 10 a.m tomorrow I'm really sad that we didn't get to go in the hot tub again today because I really loved it but there was just no time but I think Annabelle has said she's had the best time so I'm really happy that she's enjoyed it. I'm like so relieved that everything's gone well and that everybody seems to be enjoyed it, like seems to have enjoyed it. It's just so emotional and like just really wholesome, everybody helping and how much she's enjoyed it and I know that she really has. So I'm really happy. Also we dressed her up. I did get some pictures of her so I'll insert some pictures of her here if she doesn't mind um but it was great it was so funny honestly it's it's just been so good the plan for tomorrow is to leave here by 10 we might go on a little short walk around the countryside because it just looks so nice and we then have a roast booked for half past 12 on the way back which I'm so excited for honestly I cannot wait for some good food and I feel like I need so much veg all we've eaten is like beige foods so I just need some broccoli, I honestly just need some broccoli. Oh.